smoking's bad for your health. So is a fat ass. Yeah, well, there you go. Listen, to come up with that on the fly, that is actually unbelievable. Random London geezer, I can only respect you. So, on the Joking channel, we do love CLA. She's the gift that keeps on giving, and she will just scrap anybody in her immediate vicinity. She has, like, this beef with just about everything, including her own camera. What the f*** do you do so bad, Chelsea, on this app? What do you do? What, you make money? What do you do? Tell people you're, you're better than everyone else, because I am. What, you know, you're spitting facts. Listen, everything else aside, at least she is very humble. Yeah, man, we've done a couple of videos on CLA. I say a couple, it's been a fair few. But over time, I don't know what it is, but she is just getting angrier and angrier, like, every week. And at this point, it's getting kind of worrying, because I think she might be clocking on to people making videos on her. So, my mate was telling me that um, other creators have been making videos saying, Oh, Chelsea Yards, you know, subs on. Oh my god, I think I did actually say that word for word in my last CLA video. So it might actually be over, the joking channel might be finished. I always thought it would be over but it came for me, but maybe it will be CLA. Yeah, I really don't think I'm overreacting. She is a very dangerous woman. Um, by the look of her TikTok, she has some very dangerous friends. Hello darling, I'm with Tony Adley. Adley. The grip strength on that Tony bloke, that's unbelievable. I do not want to even combat this guy. If he's rolling out for CLA, it's definitely over for me. Can only respect the teeth in the background as well. He might bite my face off. Yeah, if I knew CLA was rolling with people like this, I would have never made these videos. Tony and Adley. Co. And Co. And Co. I know this guy is supposed to be like this geezer. He probably is in a football firm or something, but he does just look like that gay little monkey meme. I cannot take him seriously. And management, um, and management. Oh, and management. oh, darling. Well, I'm looking for the security suite. I'll no right. never be able yeah. to I'm get away manager, from this guy. And we oh. bumped into this little superstar. I mean, everything else aside, these people are who I was meant to be. If I didn't have an internet connection as a kid, this would actually be me. A bit of perspective is always nice, but unfortunately, this is as positive as the video gets. Because from here on, out. CLA just attacks everybody and everything. Dell comes in here, Kate Moss. You can tell them not to film neither when they're posting it on their stories. Roots. So yeah, we'll just jump straight in. CLA thinks she's on the same level as Adele and Kate Moss. You know, it's a good thing to back yourself, but maybe a bit of humility is on the cards here. The catalyst for this is very underwhelming. She was just recording herself inside. And clearly, the people that work there were not happy. I mean, if you've ever worked a retail job or like anything in the service industry, you do not want to be recorded. You just want the ground to swallow you up at all times. I hate to break it to you, but that's the reality of working those jobs, I know. And if CLA ever walked in to one of those jobs while I was working. I would have quit. I mean, you could not pay me any amount of money to tolerate that. But yeah, with CLA, it only ever takes one spark and it descended very quickly from here. But yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'm gonna keep that in, but I, I feel like my voice really trailed off there at the end. No one needs to walk around Portuguese pretending to be posh, sweetheart. I'm from the ends. No one needs to pretend, darling. I'm a real bitch, sweetheart. You know, walking around, oh, darling. Oh. <laughs> yeah, whatever. A bitch sees eggs, chips, and beans. Right, so, so far, I'm not gonna lie to you. By CLA standards, this isn't very bad yet. She is just on her own complaining, but as CLA does, she is just gonna make herself more angry. The descent into madness has begun it's just a matter of time and very quickly after this she was just in prime cla form i don't eat that dusty food anyway darling the food's terrible yeah and i will shout and scream a root stalling put your car in the place nostrils yeah so at this point she might just actually be a soundboard she just kind of repeats those catchphrases over and over without any context she has got a strong brand and i will give her that to be honest mate i might just have to follow that because uh if i had some random catchphrases that i just repeat through the video it probably would be a better video for it like and sub or i am just going to be forced to start spitting catchphrases at random intervals yes darling we'll have all the filming filming yes darling do nothing wrong about filming. Anyone want to talk about filming anymore? I'll wear a camera on my fucking head. I swear, I'm going to wear a camera on my head. Yeah, I don't think literally anybody wants that. Honestly, I'm just trying to think of this video as a perspective of somebody in that shop or sitting outside having a coffee. Imagine somebody rolling up in full bright pink, just shouting and screaming at everybody. I would genuinely feel like a responsibility to call somebody to help them. Because like at this point, we do know who CLA is and what she does. But despite how much she shouts and screams that she is famous and that everybody knows her, these people must just think she's a crackhead or something. And to be fair, would they be 
be wrong. I'm not even going to dignify that with a response because that would be disgusting. But I'll let you answer that one in your head. And to be fair, I probably know your answer. These people are too poor for me. I'm too rich for all of these people. They're too broke. And it ain't no joke. Self-made bitch. Oh, let's go. Jim Zeno, let's go, sweetheart. We'll have all that cash, darling. I'll have all that diamonds. And I'll have all that money. Yes, darling. And we're getting down the UK leaderboard. Whoa. Yeah, I'm going to double down on what I just said. If I saw a random person in bright pink doing this in public, I would call somebody. I think it might be my responsibility at that point. Like, to a certain level, I think I might just be desensitized to this. I've watched a lot of people like CLA and Alphaba trying to prep these videos. It has just become my new normal to a degree. But yeah, to view CLA through the perspective of somebody that doesn't know who she is, it just does get so much worse. How famous are you? Uh, I'm the only person in the UK that can do what I'm doing. Crack. I mean, go to any town centre, you will see a lot of people on that. Oh, she means TikTok. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. Nobody can do CLA, like CLA. I'm famous in America. Darling, look at the... Uh, imagine, I've got the Americans. Oh, uh, Roots is blowing up with all their billions of views. Um, yes, oh, uh, Roots. Famous in Africa, famous in Mexico, famous in Australia, famous in Dubai. Yeah, famous everywhere. I mean, fair enough. If you are that widespread, then I'll have to take your word for it, but fair enough. It is kind of offset by the fact they're all laughing at you, though. It's really not a flex, though. Just sacrifice your self-respect, and you are sorted on that front. CLA's well ahead of the curve on that one, though, and at this point in the video, she did start then attracting attention. Hello, are you Scottish? Yes. Oh, nice to meet you. I've got a little... Yeah, so this guy doesn't know it yet, but he actually does have the worst job in the world. This TikTok loading thing, by the way, you might think it's the web page loading. It's actually not. This is his brain in real time trying to work out what he's seeing here. And yeah, I mean, you can probably imagine how the rest of this interaction went. I'm famous in Scotland. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm Chelsea Lee Art. What do you want? Well, you're supposed to have a license as far as I know. I'm allowed to film in a public place. It's for my own safety. I'm out in public. Everyone knows me. I'm TikTok famous and it's for my security. In all my time watching these CLA clips, this is probably the most clarity she's ever spoken with. I can imagine she's probably repeated this about a thousand times. With the amount of security guards she's been approached by, it's actually no surprise. And this Scottish bloke, he just ain't ready for it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Well, big up Scotland. people famous and including that idiot fucking Biden. Who? Eddie Biden? That idiot Biden. Oh, yeah, I'm, not, I'm an artist. I paint. This is just brain rot at this point. He just randomly brings up Biden. This guy might actually be senile himself. I don't know what CLA has to do with Biden. But yeah, these two might actually be made for each other. She's given me the usual that she's got the uh, right to film in public. She's on TikTok and she's well known. Yeah, Chelsea Liot, you can Google me. Ah, oh, never mind, he snitched. It's really the ones you least expect. To be fair, I don't blame him, but that's probably break CLA's heart, let's be real. I don't care who you, you Grosvenor who owns it. So what about that? So go and tell him. Roots will have all the Grosvenors. Yes, darling. Hello, Chelsea Liot, I don't care, sweetheart. Yeah, she's actually broken him. He has gone non-verbal. I mean, I don't blame him. If I went into that situation blind, I would have no idea what to do. I'm buying my yeah, shopping. No, it's just the usual. It's going in one end and he... She reckons that she's got every right to film me. I have, because the police have told me I've got a right to film in a public place, darling. So don't stress me out and I'm going. So yeah, he let her go and she walks off. And he doesn't know it yet, but this is like releasing Godzilla into a city. Pissing CLA off and then letting her walk off freely. This is dangerous. London might fall and that is not an exaggeration. CLA is capable of levelling the whole city. But yeah, luckily for us, she did continue the stream. <laughs> Shine like a star. Cause you are, you are, you are, you are Shine like a star Cause you are You're that special star Yeah, so you know when I said that we should probably call someone I think this might be the time Oh, yes you are Shine like a star See you late. If you need help, somebody will be there. I don't know if it'll be me, but somebody will be there. Maybe. But yeah, man, if the uh, full pink outfit wasn't a cry for help enough, then this definitely is. But it is London, so this is kind of normal. People will just walk past her and maybe give her a glance at best. I genuinely don't know what it is with TikTokers singing in public. We've seen Alphabet do it, and it is like nails on a chalkboard. But to expect anything better, it's probably stupid on my part. <laughs> 
Alexa, send more info. Alexa, sign me up to Amazon Music. Why is she saying my name, Leanne? But no, don't ever call me Leanne. Yeah, so CLA might be the first person to have actual beef with Amazon Alexa. There was genuinely personal hate involved in that, and to be fair, I wouldn't expect anything else from CLA. But yeah, knowing that CLA will get pissed off at just about anything, well, it would probably be a good idea to throw it away at this point. Free trial now. Uh, yes, Alexa, please. Thank you. Sorry, I'm not sure about that. Alexa, yes! Start the free package! Yeah, this frame here is the last known image of CLA before her Amazon Alexa just disassembled her. Some would say it's a terrible tragedy. I'm gonna sit on the fence on this one personally. But I mean, all jokes aside, Alexa might actually be a net positive for CLA. Because while it is probably gonna shock you how little CLA knows about reality, Alexa, it might just be giving her like a long overdue education. Alexa, is the moon a spaceship? No. Mm. Refuses to elaborate, just a straight no. Her reaction is just hilarious to be fair, and I was kind of agnostic as to whether it was a bit, but somehow, and it might not be hard to believe given everything we know about CLA, she's not joking. As I said, she has some really weird views and opinions about reality, and luckily for us, this does extend to discussions about aliens. I hey, listen, I definitely believe this. You know they made that film, what is it? Um... Iguanas, not iguanas. That's a reptile. Um Avatar. That box office hit Iguanas, I mean, it was a great film to be fair. I mean, I've observed this, and I'm sure you have too, in like every single TikToker that I've ever made a video on. And these people, like their brains must just be mush. I don't know what it is about TikTok Live, but it must just kill brain cells on another level. Either way, I'm gonna go against my better judgment, and hey, I'm gonna hear her out here. I mean, CLA can only bestow wisdom upon us at this point. I believe that that exists, and they made that film based on the existence of what they've got. I reckon there is uh, a planet, you know, I reckon that we come from aliens, like um, part of an alien. There was eight different aliens and you know the humans resemble every alien, uh, different alien. I have no idea what she just said, but do you know what? I believe her. I mean, CLA is probably more qualified than every single scientist in the world. We definitely do come from iguanas. I mean, Avatar. And to be fair, I've probably learned all I need to know from CLA. One thing CLA needs to learn herself, though, is what real journalism is. Because uh, she's got her story and she's trying to sell it to newspapers. But for some reason, she chose the sun and it went as bad as you can probably expect. Oh, hello, Mark. Um, hi, I'm a big, like, I'm a famous TikToker, British artist. My name's Chelsea Leon. Um, basically, I needed to speak to someone because I need to do a big story because we're being, tro uh, like, me, especially, I've been trolled now for two years where police keep coming. So, the tr you know, I'm a famous TikToker. I've got billions of views. I've got millions of followers. And I work for TikTok in the comfort of my own house, uh, live streaming. Uh, humble, as always. I mean, her humbleness is definitely her best trait. But yeah, this clip was uploaded to TikTok in, like, fast-forward mode. And I would just change it back, but I think listening to her in fast-forward actually does add to it. You can really just kind of feel how much she does yap and in some of these clips she just doesn't stop talking for like a minute at a time basically uh, the trolls are trolling me and another tiktoker to the point of this has been going for two years i don't even have a secure door on my property they keep coming to my house uh saying this saying that it's just uh, and we need to find out who's doing this this could be one sick individual that's calling on and you know like they say that you know i went on holiday i can't go nowhere i can't come out of the house can't do this can't do that they say i've got a fire on they say i'm dead in the property they do this police are coming out every other day fire services ambulances like every day listen in all fairness to see like, while well, she doesn't shut up what is happening to her uh, isn't great. I mean, it is impossible to know the full scale of what she's going through. I wouldn't trust a word out of the mouth for somebody that calls Avatar iguanas, but she is definitely being harassed to a level. And while she does kind of bring it on herself, and I don't know if that is bad to say, it sucks and it's not fair, but like you have to play the cards you're dealt. And if you've got a target on your back, you've got to be at least a little bit pragmatic. But this is CLA, to be fair. I'll let you take a guess as to whether she's going to do that. You look just Probably about um, over 200. About over what period of time? Over two years. 200 times in two years. Yeah. How do, how do you think these people know your address? Is it really on the internet or something? Yeah, the, 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 it, my address has been leaked, so I can't go nowhere. I can't even go on holiday, like, wherever I go. I mean, I don't really need to say anything myself. The text on the screen says it all. Maybe, and this is just a guess. Maybe stupid actions do have bad consequences. Once CLA learns that fact, her life might get a little bit easier. The cat might be out of the bag at this point, though, so uh, I don't really see a resolution, at least on this front. Oh, how's it been leaked, do you know? 
I've got millions of fans, darling. I can't walk out my house. My neighbors know who I am. The, uh, fucking security, everyone knows who I am. So I don't know, darling. You tell me when you're famous like me, sweetheart. I'm the most biggest UK TikToker in the UK. I make a lot of money. I I'm rich as well, so. Oh, uh, yeah. When she goes off on one, it is literally over. I mean, the guy is just asking questions and she's firing shots. When you're famous like me, then you tell me. I mean, I would just hang up the phone if I was him. I'm not going to lie. I've got, listen, I'm an icon, yeah. I've got the whole UK copying me. They all scream roots. Well, yeah, I'm TikTok. What do you want us to do about it? Right, so I'm, I want to do a big, I want to do a story about it. It's I can indeed confirm that the whole UK does not scream roots. There are maybe two or three people that scream roots. One of them is CLA. The delusion is on another level, but to be fair to her, this would actually make for a good story. Sadly, it never materialised, and who could tell why? I mean, she was very polite on the phone, and that guy has really done her dirty. Luckily for CLA, though, there are so many phone numbers out there where she can redirect her anger. And luckily for us, that's exactly what she did. Pass this over for information, then. Is there a particular person that you want to report at all? But I don't want to... Basically, I want to report that someone's being trolled like me. Do you understand that? The fact that we are being harassed, so someone else is going through yeah. harassment and stalking, they get letters sent to them. I got a gas mask sent to my house. Do you want to investigate that? Being sent a gas mask. In the grand scheme of things, I don't know why she's so upset about a gas mask. I mean, people have sent her like tarantulas and stuff. We saw that in the last video. But yeah, so far, at least by CLA standards, so good. Like she hasn't fully switched yet, but believe me, it's coming. Tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow afternoon. Do you have a preferred time? No, just okay. any, t any time. Okay. I don't leave my house, sweetheart. I'm too famous. I can't walk okay. the streets. Do you want to walk streets with me? Uh, I, this is exactly what she did on the phone to that guy like a minute ago. This must be muscle memory at this point. I mean, the girl on the phone said absolutely nothing. It's really painful behaviour. And the girl on the phone, she's probably on like minimum wage, having to deal with people like this all day. To record her and kind of put her out on the internet for everybody to listen to, it's just not on. And I don't know what it's going to take to humble CLA, but it's going to take something big. Yeah, definitely. Um, I'll send you a reference on the short bit. All right, thank you so much for being professional okay. and kind Take and helpful. Care. Okay, thank you. Bye, darling. No worries. Bye bye. Okay, so she was nice for like a second and then she immediately undercut it. She has got a real attitude. I mean, she is authentic, if nothing else. Maybe like top five worst people to deal with in a customer service job. Maybe globally, but I guess we'll never know. And hopefully, hopefully you never have to encounter her in the wild. If you do, just run. Like, don't stand up to it. No amount of money is worth that. And the worst thing about all of this is, is that she just does not have the self-awareness to know that she is the problem. You know, what gets me is the fact that they just don't understand. They're, they're not educated to understand. The police are thick as f***. That's why I can't deal with them. They make me scream. They're so thick. Yeah, once again, the text on the screen just does explain everything perfectly. When you're just rambling and shouting, normally it doesn't have a productive outcome. But this is CLA, so no matter how many words I say, nothing is ever going to get through to her. She'll never change. As I said, she's authentic and we'll give her that. But that is probably about as much as I can give her. But to be fair, I don't need to give her any credit. She gives herself enough credit as it is. Like, you've got police that are just... Yeah, if I was working for the... I'd be a lawyer. Subscribe or I sentence you to have a CLA as a lawyer. And let's be real, if that's the case, then you are going straight to jail.